Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve your coming across error on your Windows 10 device where your password may have expired or the remote PC may not accept blank passwords. So this should hopefully be a fairly straightforward tutorial and without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So we're going to begin by opening up the star menu, type in settings, Press match to go back with settings right above app. So go ahead and left click on that. Select the system tile. Now you want to scroll down and select the remote desktop on the left side. And you want to toggle enable remote desktop to the on position. It's going to ask enable remote desktop. You and users selected under user accounts will be able to connect to this PC remotely. Select confirm. And once you've done that, you want to scroll down a little bit until you find the option where it says select users that can remotely access this PC and left click on that. So you want to go ahead and just select the add option. And now into this field, you want to go just type in everyone. And then select check names. And then select OK. Once you've done that, you are good to so go select OK. And now that you've done that, you can go ahead and close out of here. Open up the Star menu, type in Control Panel. Best match to go back with Control Panel right above App. So go ahead and left click on that. Select your View By and select Lart Icons. And then go down to System. And just left click on that. Select Remote Settings on the left side. And now you want to select where it says allow remote connections to this computer. And you want to uncheck the box where it says allow connections only from computers running remote desktop with network level authentication. And then you want to go select the apply and OK. Close out of here. Open up to our menu again. Type in Windows Defender Firewall. You want to open that up. Select Advanced Settings on the left side. Select Inbound Rules on the left side. And now you want to go down to something that says Remote Desktop Shadow. So scroll down here. And double click on it. Make sure it's set to Enabled. And now you want to go select the Advanced tab. Underneath Edge Transversal, you want to click inside of here and select Allow Edge Traversal. And then once you're done with that, select Apply and OK. Close out of here. Now I want you guys to open up the Star menu again. Type in Services. Press Match to go back with Services. So go ahead and left click on that. Locate the Remote Desktop Services. Double click on that. You want to select the Stop option. Select Yes. Then select Start. Set Startup Type to Automatic. Then select Apply and OK. Close out of here. Restart your computer and that should be about it. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.